All right. Good morning. So um, yesterday, oh, you know what? Subscribe, hit the bell, hit the like. Join me on Twitter at trading underscore off. And now that that's out of the way, oh, yeah, a few more things. Um, yo, you got a little spare change in your pocket? Go and jing a ling a ling. Um, hit me up. The, we have a PayPal account. Um, there's a Patreon account. Um, you can tip on uh, Twitter. Um, all the loot goes to helping me build the channel. I want to get some uh, educational content content out there. Um, any assistance would be appreciative. I got some free folk helping me out, throwing videos out there, putting the thumbnails on, and doing all the stuff I can't do. Um, they're, they're donating their time, but I would like to compensate them a little bit, get them some software to get professional and uh, motivate them. So if you could help us out, that'd be great. Okay. Um, right to it, uh, Amazon came out, the market um, rallied all night, and um, even the psycho broker was calling me. I was so excited how up we were, but here we are. Um, it's probably about 6, 6.30 right now, and the markets are flat, and I'm expecting the market to open up flat. So if we look at uh, the daily and we open up flat, oh, that's the 60 minute. Let's not look at that since that's not the daily. Here's the daily. All my lines all over it. Hard to see. Look past all of the trend lines. We open up flat. Um, I like it. I'm anticipating that we head down, tag this um, 380 and make a hammer. Um, and that's what I'm looking for. We make that hammer. And I think um, Monday we, we start to move up. This is all conjecture. There's nothing to support it. Um, so I would like another down day, to tell you the truth, one more down day, and then make a hammer and pop up. That could be the case, too. You might get a hammer um, on Monday. And three down bars with two straight down bars and one hammer would give me, I would feel comfortable with that being a reversal pattern. Um, and that would make a higher low, and then we could anticipate it moving higher. And if it breaks this high right here, then we could say that we're in a consolidation um, until we make another higher low and move up higher, and then we could say we're back into a, a bull move. Because right now, the daily is um, bearish. Um, here's the high, um, here's the low, lower high, lower low, lower high. So now um, this... I mean, if we stay in a bearish move, then we're going to make a lower low. Ooh, that's going to be scary. Um, I'll have people calling me left and right. So that's what we're looking for. That's what I feel. Um, I really don't see a reason for the market to go um, into a bearish market. Um, maybe not as aggressive as it was uh, while the feds were dropping interest rates or, or throwing money at the market. Excuse me, a little coffee. Um, but I do, um, I feel the economy is in great shape. Um, I think we're going to come in for a soft landing. I think they're going to handle it well. I mean, this guy Biden's a bozo and really not um, taking any action to offset a cost. You, you know, like um, oil creeped up towards 80. Trump was all about releasing um, the the um, the um, military uh, surplus or, or, or stocks. Um, hammered those prices down, worked with, um, the, the oil companies to get those prices down. This guy does nothing, nothing. What an empty suit. I knew this was a mistake. I mean, I'm not a pro Trumper. I'm not anti Trumper either, but uh, yeah, you know, yo, I'm about the merits of each individual. I believe you can get the best out of people. That's good management. I've been managing people since I'm 19 and uh, it doesn't matter who the guy is, you, you know, a good manager gets the best out of people. Um, we should get the best out of our president. Not the case, not the case. Just a bunch of dumb people. Oh, we don't like his language. All ah, right, that was important. Okay, so anyway, that's what we're looking at at the market right here. Sorry about um, the little ramp break. Um, and um, as far as uh, the, 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 the um, momentum, yeah, it's rolling. Yeah, I think we got another two days of down market or so. And then we get a, uh, a reflection, a reversion, rather, um, on the momentum, and it moves, it pushes back up without um, going negative. 
Um, let's take a quick look at um, the the futures right now. So the futures actually is setting up a really nice bear flag. Um, and if we close around here today, we may very well in, in, in the S&P um, go up, meet this and then close down, you, you know, just fill this bar, keep an inside bar, create this bear flag, and then we're going to push up. But I don't think this is going to be a very aggressive bear flag. I think we still need a, a better move down. So that's why I'm hoping for a, a, a few moves down and then a move up on, on the, uh, on the uh, S&P. But looking at the future, this is a good bear flag. If we close here Monday break that, we're going to move up. Um, at the very least, we're going to test this high of 587 um, and then maybe break it. But this is not what I want to see. Um, and it looks like we could take a, a few more days uh, of a move down. Let's look at that uh, 240. And yeah, that 240 is looking kind of weak. What do we got? Another three hours for that 240. So that 240 closes when the market opens today as it did a reversion, which means it could do another push down. It's breaking this uh, overnight low of 62. Or at least it's flirting with it right now. If it breaks that, that'll be a good move. I do want to see a retrace, a little bit of a retrace. I want to see, um, I want to see it uh, uh, um, flush some cheap stock out um, on the S and P, and then um, turn around and go. This is too soon, just too soon to turn around and buy, bounce. Um, if we open flat and break this, it triggers the the bull flag right here. And then we'll probably challenge that high. But I don't know if we'll have the energy to um, push through that high, especially after you get these little wicks to the downside over here. Um, so, again, I want to see it move down. I would like to see the uh, 4390. Actually, uh, if it held 4408, um, I'd like that even better. Just tag the 4408, turn around. Um, like Monday, and that's the best case scenario. But as it stands right now, we just chilling. Um, we're going to open flat. We'll look for that break of the low. We could take that break of the low and see if we can run this bad boy down um, and, and make a few uh, shekels um, this Friday. It is going to be a warm day, so I am um, kind of enticed to go out and play. Uh, so if you don't hear from me, that's what's happened. I've wrapped up the day early, hopped on my weekend, and split. And that's why we um, live that uh, off grid life so that we're not a slave to the machine and we could actually um, partake in the finer things of life. So, um, that being said, um, remember everybody, yo, when you're trading, you got to be calm and cool. You should be at peace and good luck trading.